Hello everyone, we're back. And when we left off, we uh, saved Clementine and saved Sean and Chet. And mm, let's see who else we can save. So this is our group of survivors. Oh. I guess we're there's more survivors, I guess. Hey Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snip. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. And then there were three. And now there are Thank four God again. You're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you, then. You've brought a couple guests. Uh, b -b 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 your, boy. your boy's a lifesaver. Life glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He's... Well, just some guy who found her alone. That's me. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Oh. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. No, it is not. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go sister, see what I have. Sister, man, you have a whole bunch of people here. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Hmm. Well, it could, be, could worse. be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's, it's Lee. Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. <gasps> I'm Herschel, Herschel Green. Herschel! Oh my god! Herschel from the comic books and the TV show! Oh How'd this happen? And that's Sean! That's the... I. That's, that's Sean. He... That's so. Oh, man. Where were you headed before the car accident? Oh, I was headed um, out of Atlanta. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl. <laughs> a police officer. I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. Mm -hmm. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Oh, Can't she's imagine shy. what you've been through, Clementine. I'm oh looking after her until we uh, find her parents. So this dude, this is Sean. Hey, Dad. So you I'm read thinking, the comic books for seeing the show. We got that's a reinforced a zombie defense in the around the farm. That doesn't oh, seem Oh, but that means he's gonna... Oh, no. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think hey, anyone... Hey, don't swear in front of my little head. girl. Um, your son's your right. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. Okay, what is this? I saw a man got run over, a dead cop crawling on the ground, people... Uh, a girl Teenage with her guts. Girl with her guts spilled out on the floor, stood up from the dead and tried to bite me. Yeah. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We got to do it, really. I Sounds already right. said okay. Jeez. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. Mm. What do we do then? Well, we'll probably just have infection. to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards Macon, I suppose.
All right then. Hmm. Hey, there's the dispatched family he was talking about. It smells like. Um. Uh, yeah. But, uh, but, uh, you know. I know what it smells like. Duty. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? <laughs> Pretty far. Pretty far. Oh. Okay. Me and Lee are so alike. He says man, I say man. Except, uh, my leg's a lot better than his. And I don't live in a zombie apocalypse. I love you, baby. <laughs> Oh, that must have been when Lee uh, murdered the dude. Flashback. <clears throat> hey, get up. <sighs> oh, I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> hey, but don't I bet scare your my daddy girl. scared them all away, huh? I'm not her dad. Uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, Why does everyone think I'm her dad? A tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Uh. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad. See. The word is you were on your way to Macon. Yep. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Uh... Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. Build a fence. Yeah, well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Huh. So, okay then. Here we are on the farm. Uh, you, I need to talk to you. Hey there, Kenny. Uh, Kenny? How's, How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. Rapist. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government'll start handing out shots and the National Guard'll do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Okay, Kenny's got a boat. Need any help? No, I think I got it. He's do got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Um, I have no, I have no idea. idea what I'm doing. <laughs> At least you're honest. Shit, better than I was when Duck showed up. You'll figure it out. See you. All right, Kenny. Got nothing else to say to me? I'll go talk to your wife. You know, they call me. You Ooh. having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Lee, wife stealer. Okay. Uh, can I. Oh, can hey I... there, girls. What do you so, do? Uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? 
I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Oh, well, uh, I was fired. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. Alright, uh, yeah, how was How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... Uh, it's okay. Just, it's fine. just... You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... The things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? <laughs> nope. Uh, okay, who would? Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? You hmm. two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. That's good. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, um, uh, how was that? It's easy. <laughs> well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? Yeah. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Alright, Clementine, you're a first grader. You're pretty young. <laughs> you're younger than I was expecting, anyway. Okay, um... Okay, well, I think that's all for this episode, guys. Uh, thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, click like. And if you really like this video, subscribe so you can see the rest of my videos. Thanks so much again for watching. Bye.